Good evening everyone and welcome to Let's Play Mega Man 3 for the Game Boy. Today we are at Wily's Fortress or whatever the hell this place is. And uh Oh there's Wily, and Wily, like a sick fucking pervert, can do nothing but raise his eyebrows at us. Told you he had a robot fetish. Oh, and this is Punk. Uh, the uh, saw blade wielding robot, and Mega Man wisely chases after Punk instead of Wily, you know? I mean, whatever, you know, go after the uh, saw blade robot and not the uh, guy you're trying to kill who's right behind you. But, you know, whatever. I mean, you, we could do this first, you know. I mean, he didn't even chase after you. He went down there, but it's, it's okay. We gotta do it. Now, Punk is one of the cooler-looking enemies in the game, I think. Um, also, I think he's also the hardest boss in the game. Uh, mainly because you have to watch his moves really closely and react quickly. So, uh, <clears throat> what happens is, first of all, he does a shit ton of damage. He does, takes out about a third of your life every time you get hit by him. So you can only screw up about three times or more if you have E-Tanks like we do. Ha ha ha. So basically, um, when he does that little uh, charge attack of his, you have to watch. Um, it can either go high or low. Um, also, don't die. That's another thing. But yeah, it can either go high or low. So if it goes high, you can jump over it um, and you know totally dodge that. If you if it goes low, or sorry, if it goes high, you can roll underneath it. If it goes low, you have to jump over it. So, but it's a it's a very quick dash, so you have to watch really closely and make sure you're paying attention and be on the ball and everything like that, uh, like not like that. So, uh, <clears throat> luckily we have like we've been saving up a ton of E tanks. So uh, this is basically the fight you need to use it in. I mean, you don't even need to. Technically, you could do this. You know, I mean, any, all these bosses you can pretty much do without getting hurt. But um, I'm lazy, so I'm just gonna use E tanks. Um, also, I didn't mention before, if you end up continuing the game with a password, you, you lose all your E-Tanks, so want to make that is uh, one good thing about not using continues. So, and here we go. Uh, one more hit. One more hit. And there he goes. Punk is dead. So now we've given Dr. Wily ample time to escape, so we have to chase after him. Oh yeah, and we get uh, Punk's new ability. Or Mega Man's new ability, Punk's old ability, and it is Screw Crusher, which makes no sense because we're shooting saw blades and not screws, but you know, whatever. And uh, there's Dr. Wily again, raising his fucking eyebrows like a pervert. You're an asshole, Dr. Wily. And that is Atlantis! No, it's the oil platform. And it looks like a skeleton because it's evil. All right, now we have to go through the oil platform. This is the longest level in the game, without a doubt. Um, probably pretty close to uh, Dustman's level, but it's kind of drags on, honestly. Like a lot of these rooms are just like, you know, all the enemies we've encountered throughout the game, and have to kill them. It's not really hard or anything, it's just a really long level. So, oh god damn it. Fucking welding helmet guy, I hate you so much. The guy gets you every time, he just comes out of fucking nowhere and charges at you with his welding helmet. You're really fucking dead now, asshole. Anyway, I'm gonna skip those bats. Oh yeah, uh, pretty sure I died twice here because this platform's kind of rough. I mean, these platforms, period, are kind of rough. They, uh, you have to jump this pretty much the split second you land on it, and if your timing's off, or if you have something, you know, you got sprite lag, it makes it a lot harder. So, um, yeah, pro tip, don't die on these things. Um, anyway, <clears throat> so we're finally going to get past that. Of course, we're uh, also going to get hit by that ball there. But that's cool. Um, lots of spikes after this, I'm pretty sure. Um, got to use Rush Jet here. Uh, if, as you can see, there's a long corridor there with a bunch of spikes in there, so... Got his rush jet to get through. Pretty sure he goes until he hits a wall, so I'm pretty sure you can ride on him for an indefinite amount of time until he hit a wall, of course. Um, that was kind of mean, trying to get you to run into those spikes there. And I get owned by grenades. Those are some big guys. Oh! There's fucking Bolo Man again. 
God damn it, Bolo Man. Why can't you just leave us alone? I think he'd learn some new tactics by now. I mean, really. Come on. You really just gotta sit there throwing your Bolo in the exact same direction? What's your deal, man? You were poorly programmed. That's all I'm saying. You should get a new job. Oh, and now we're vi visited by the dead Bolo Man. Of course, he's dead again now. He's re-dead. He was undead, and now he's re-dead. That was Dive Missile, by the way. Probably one of the better weapons in the game. It's, uh, it's like a sea it's a torpedo that seeks out anything. It also does a pretty good amount of damage, so uh, it has a fairly good rate of fire. Definitely one of the better weapons. Uh, unfortunately, you won't see a lot of playtime because we're already at the final level, but... God damn it, Bolo Man. Go away. Seriously. Like, you're just everywhere. I think, I think you'd learn by now. Nope. There we go. We gotta fight a menacing popcorn machine again. Wily, your robots are so freaking weird. You, you had it right with Punk. I mean, come on. Punk's a cool robot. But a uh, popcorn machine robot, you know... Yeah, no, I don't think so. Back to the drawing board with that one. This area is just about avoiding these spikes coming out of the floor here. It's, uh, you just gotta know they're there, basically. Like, like a lot of other parts in the later Mega Man levels, you just have to know things are there. It's not very uh, first-time user-friendly, that's for sure. So yeah, lots of rooms with just... See, like, what's the point of... Well, I guess I see the point of this room, but I mean, come on. Just lots of random rooms that don't even need to be there. They just want it to be long, I guess. This room's completely pointless. Who's gonna miss that? Uh, that that's another wall up there that we can use the drill bomb on to uh, break, as you can see. And then we gotta use Rush Jet to get up there and grab an E-Tank. Uh, or not Rush Jet, we can use Rush Coil as well. Better idea. <clears throat> oh, there's our buddy Eddie. Uh, we can't do the trick here, so he gives us a shitty item, of course. Can't really rely on him. He's not a very reliable little toilet. Oh man, that was a very, very lucky drop. Awesome. We totally would have died right there. Oh, this is a good spot to use, Search Snake. Oh man, more popcorn. Right, what are those in the background? They look like fucking shutters or something. Oh man, hey, no. Oh, I haven't seen this guy in a while. Giant Jackhammer Man. What the hell are those things, man? Those are freaking. Those are freaking crazy with their googly eyes and wild jumping. I don't even know. God damn it, Bolo Man. Respect my boundaries, seriously. Just. Get a restraining order against you. Just show up everywhere. But we gotta fight Giant Susie again. Kind of easier the second time for some reason. I don't know. I didn't have to, I didn't have to use an E tank or anything. Apparently, uh, she has a weakness. Um, I guess her weakness is Spark Shock. But uh, honestly, I've always just used the, the uh, regular Charge Up Buster. It works pretty pretty decently, you know. You'd think that would be the end, but no. We still have more of the level to go. Oh joy. Just a bunch of random rooms with random enemies. Oh my god! That's it. Restraining order time. Well, at least he gave us a life. Maybe that's his way of saying sorry. Sorry I stalk you. He's kind of like that duck in Paper Mario. You guys ever play Paper Mario? It's like that duck that keeps coming back and every time he gets owned. But he never learns his lesson. Freaking die. I'm gonna use dive missile there. So I guess there's a lot of windows here because there's shutters all over the freaking place. I don't I don't even know. I don't I don't even care anymore, Dr. Wily. Your your creations are too strange for me. I'm going to kill you. Oh, way to miss those health power ups, douchebag. There. Giant jumping dude. No idea what the hell this guy's called. Eh. 
And oh my God, Bolo Man! I, you know, I don't even care anymore. I don't even care. Just die. Oh, and here we go. That was the end. And next time we are going to face Dr. Wily. See you guys then. Goodbye.